commissioners presented their proposed budget before the public this morning. In it, they are proposing the county reduce their workforce by about 30 positions. Firefighters, sheriff deputies, department heads, and the community members packed into the commissioner's courtroom. The county is facing a deficit of about $1.6 million due to a loss in mineral values. The new budget is calling for a reduction in staff for several departments, including emergency services. The sheriff's department is being asked to eliminate up to 10 positions and the fire department too. Both the sheriff and the fire chief made the argument to keep what they have. However, they made some compromises. The fire chief says he's willing to close one of the vacant positions that's still open, but is requesting to keep one of the two that he's been asked to eliminate. As for the sheriff, he was initially asking for four more positions, but when pressed by commissioner's court, he said he might consider reducing three of the ten positions that they wanted him to cut. Judge Rathmel says agreeing to these requests for these both departments could mean a sacrifice to other departments in the county. There may be... Uh have to be some further reductions in other departments to offset the increases if they're approved uh, that these departments are requesting. So that there may be some, yes, yeah, some, some collateral damage to other departments. A few other requests were made before the board to get them to reconsider making deductions to their staffs. But these staff reductions are also affecting commissioners themselves. They're losing one employee each this new year. The county auditor's office is taking down each request and calculating how much it would cost the county to approve them. During their next budget meeting, commissioners will vote either to approve or deny these requests. Reporting from the courthouse at the Spot the County, I'm Valerie Gonzalez for KGNS.